My name is Joshua Lanham, I'm in Diesel, and I'm in the 12th grade. I picked Diesel because for the longest time, uh, I've been working on things with my father. He was actually a diesel mechanic, and he's also currently a truck driver. So my entire life, I've been really working on heavy equipment. My name is Olivia Beebe, and I'm a junior in Diesel at Cheney. Personally, I selected Diesel because when I came down here, it felt like a family, and I always love working with my hands, so I figured this would be perfect for me. In shop, we learn tons of hands-on skills, Really things like engine diagnostics, uh, electrical systems. Excavator simulator. We have a fire truck that we recently got where we're able to learn like the older systems of a diesel. We have a lot of snap-on scanners and uh, multimeters. And we also have a ton of engines that get brought in and we get to learn why they're not working. One thing we do a lot is bus inspections and us juniors and seniors get to go out on production is what we call it, where we leave the school, go to other schools and double check, make Make sure all their buses are up to par. We get to check to make sure there's nothing missing, the steering is up to par, the batteries are full and charged, there's no holes in the tires, the tread depth is good. Make sure there's no extensive rust or anything to, so that the students are able to get where they need to go without any issues. So I received multiple certifications, the student level ASC certifications which include brakes, engines, electrical equipment, uh, inspections and steering. We also have snap-on certifications for the multimeters. We have SB2, we have WD40, and those are pretty much like how to use their product. We also have PB Blaster, which we got freshman year. The benefit of getting these certifications now is that we can show to employers that we are serious in our field and we want to work and it also helps us like start working for somebody sooner than later because some jobs might require certain certifications. The work that we do for the National Guard is mainly A services, so changing oil, doing filters. Sometimes they'll have bigger jobs run in, like I actually had to do a uh, brake job on a trailer, and that's what I think like the main benefits of going to the National Guard are. We get to learn so much there. We're able to do any services that they need, like preventative maintenance, so that the vehicles are where they need to be and how they need to be. Uh, personally, I've done a radiator where we've taken it off, replaced the water pump, and then put it all back on again. And that really allowed me to understand how the radiators work and those systems work. It's just perfect for experience. It just gives us the upper hand. In the future, I'm more prepared to go into uh, Marines where I can work on their engines. There's uh, trains that you can work on. There's over road vehicles. There's light duty vehicles, which is just like typical passenger vehicles with diesel engines. There's a wide variety of what you can do because of this trade. After graduation, I plan on joining the Army, being a mechanic in the diesel field. And I also plan on, after the Army, opening up my own diesel shop. After graduating, I, uh, I plan on going into the military. And when I get out of the military, I'm going to go to school to get my class A CDL. And in that time that I'm in schooling, I'm most likely going to be working at a diesel shop. And also the benefits of having this knowledge now are that when I, am, when I do have a class A CDL and I am driving, it'll be nice because if I ever have any small things have to get done to the truck that I personally own, I'll be able to do them myself. In Connecticut, there's a huge demand for diesel mechanics because there's such a wide variety of what diesel mechanics are. There's just a big age gap, so there's a huge entry for diesel mechanics currently that it has to be filled.